Stock trading is a topic that has always, always been on my mind, and it's more like a diversification option, but also very, very fun to be part of this stock trading wave or whatever and day trading. I know some of you guys might look at it as the only option, but I'm actually looking to diversify with my other ways of making money online. But in this specific video, I actually am opening a brand new stock trading account because Elon Musk actually convince me to do so hi everyone this is Christian here on YouTube and welcome to a brand new video for the channel in today's video I'm actually opening a brand new account with a stock trading broker so that I can start stock trading based on different predictions and I don't know I might be new at stock trading but hey if you're new to my channel and you're uh, uh, and you're into binary options, forex trading, crypto trading, or any type of making money online, then this channel is for you. Make sure you hit that subscribe button below and activate the notifications bell icon so that you get a notification of every new video that I upload. With that being said, let's jump into the video. All right, I just wanna say that yes, I am fairly new at stock trading, even though I know like the basics, I know the mechanisms, and I know some and majority of strategies have actually uh, day traded with stocks before. It's not something that I'm actually mastered of, but it is something that I've always wanted to be part of. The only problem is that in my country, it's fairly hard to actually find good brokers to work with, but now it seems like there are more options and that's the reason why I'm actually doing it. So just to keep that in mind. Now, let's go ahead and talk about Elon Musk buying Twitter. Why is it that I'm talking about Elon Musk buying Twitter? Because this is something that a lot of people have been talking throughout the last few days. And it's something that actually got into my mind when I started with this thinking about opening my account with stock trading. And more importantly, actually knowing or trying to understand, hey, are actually stocks like manipulated but the, these type of news so this is something we're gonna find out now one thing is clear is that no uh, i mean throughout the last couple of days twitter has not been really affected that much by elon musk's and you know his offer or whatever it actually has been dropping throughout the last few hours ever since this happened what i, I think it was april 13th uh today the 15th yeah it was on the 13th so it was around right here and the price actually jumped a little bit and then it dropped a little bit. So it hasn't really changed that much, but these are the news that actually got me thinking into this specific type of investing. For those of you who don't know what I'm talking about and you guys are like kind of confused or something like that, make sure, make sure that you uh, follow me on Twitter. All right, the link is in the description. And also take a look at Elon Musk's latest tweet. So basically he made an offer on Twitter on April 14th and uh, he wants to buy Twitter, like just like that. He offered $43 billion on Twitter because uh, he wants to own it. He thinks he has a lot of more potential for this social network, which I actually trust him, honestly. But uh, he wanted to actually buy this uh, company and if they didn't sell it to him, then, you know, he was going to withdraw all of his amount of shares, which I believe is like around 9% or something like that. It's a big amount. I'm not 100% sure. But yeah. And then he keeps on attacking Twitter and uh, sharing tweets. I love Elon Musk, honestly. But here's the deal. With he, him actually buying it, he might be uh, using Dutchcoin for Twitter as well to buy uh, advertising. I don't know. There's a bunch of things behind this Elon Musk offer, but this is basically what's got me thinking about stocks in the first place. So I decided to open a brand new trading account with a stockbroker. Now here's the deal. In my country, there are very few options. For instance, Robinhood, TD Ameritrade, these are brokers that are not allowed in my country or they don't allow me actually to use these brokers. So I decided to just Google stock trading broker for my country, right? You guys are seeing it right here. So the first broker that I got is an ad, okay? 
it's an ad. It's not really, uh, you know, uh, optimized, not SEO found. But I could go through more uh, just blogs and whatever. But I actually heard some good things about this broker, FX Pro. This is not a promotional video, not affiliated with them. But I decided to actually go with them. So I opened this new trading account and I deposited $300 in order to start with this journey now i don't know why but it still shows pending or whatever only thing that i didn't like is that they don't actually have uh bitcoin deposits but i do guess that i don't know i can just go ahead and put in my credit card if it was going to be bitcoin then i would have deposited i don't know a thousand dollars or something like that but three hundred dollars is going to do the trick so we can actually start now i know i'm going to get questions like chris why is it that you're depositing three hundred dollars not ten thousand dollars if you've made so much money chris well the reason why is because I want to be conservative at the beginning because I want to understand different things in regards to stock trading. But the coolest thing is that I'm going to be using C Trader. Now, why is this so cool? Is because I don't like uh, MT4. I, I mean, I, I just I don't. But uh, I love C Trader. Right? I, I just it's just the best. Okay. So with this specific broker, what I can do is I can trade cryptocurrencies. I can trade currencies as usual. I can, uh, can trade with stocks if I'm not mistaken. If I, don't, if I can trade with stocks, then I'm going to have to switch a broker. But I do like the broker itself. It does offer you uh, an easy way to limit stop order and actually to see what percentage you're actually risking with your trades and so on. So it's actually one of the easiest platforms to trade either Forex, stocks, cryptocurrencies in the world. So that's one of the reasons why I actually got convinced. Yes, I, it, it does show actually IC Trader because I do have it, uh, IC Markets because I do have it connected with IC Markets as well. But I decided to use this specific broker. We're going to see how that one actually goes. So, But that's the reason why I decided to deposit only $300 and not jump with thousands of dollars at the beginning. Now, what strategies am I going to be using? Look, on YouTube, if I actually just search for stock trading, there is a bunch of stock trading tri tricks, uh, strategies, secrets, and fake, obviously, videos as well. But there are many groups that send signals for stock trading. So I do think that's going to be like the first thing that I'm going to do. Join a few groups on, uh, I don't know, Facebook, Telegram, uh, Discord, or uh, anywhere where I can actually get some signals. And then we can start from there. One of the coolest things in regards to this world is that there are so many good people day trading stocks that I can actually take example of. That's pretty much the reason why, you know, I'm not going to extend that much into it. But if you actually go into, for instance, binary options or Forex trading, then uh, you already know that there are some shady stuff going on in there, right? But I do believe that we're going to actually find some really good groups that we can uh, be part of. And I don't know, maybe in the future we can cre create our own BLW stock trading group. Now, stock trading or Forex trading, because I know you guys are going to ask me like, hey, are you going to stop Forex and binary? No, it's not stopping. It's just diversifying. It's a whole different world. And I just want to explore it. So if you guys want to be part of it and you want to learn what I'm going to be learning for the next few weeks, then I highly recommend you to be subscribed to this YouTube channel and hit that subscribe button, activate the notifications icon because I'm going to be posting videos every single week in regards to how this journey is actually going to be doing so hopefully i can see you in this youtube channel hey so hopefully you enjoyed the content of this video and if you did smash the like button to support this youtube channel but hey if you're new into my channel and you haven't really subscribed and you want to see more videos just like this one hit that subscribe button below thank you for watching this video and i'll see you on the next one